Seeing your father's a bad idea. Saying goodbye on the radio. It's the best thing to do. When I was seven, I wanted a dog in the worst way. But uh, my dad has always had allergies real bad. One day, he came home with a brand new puppy and a grin ear to ear. Even though my dad hates needles, he got a shot every week for 14 years and never said one word. Daryl, I'm half the person he is, and he loves me twice as much as I deserve. You're not going to evacuate, are you? He's my dad. What would you do in my place? around, Hillbilly. You'll come in handy. here.
Did Aiden send you? Who's Aiden? My husband, Aiden, still knows how to signal the last evac helicopter out. He was supposed to be back by now. He went to check on the Harrisons, in the house across the street. I'll go look there, then. Looking for the evacuation point? You Harrison? I'm trying to find Aiden. Lady across the street said he was here. Lady? Oh, Jane. Yes, Aiden was just here, but left for the mechanic shop just down the road. You should be able to catch him. Please tell him to begin. It won't be much longer now. Oh, yes, there's a pharmacy in the shopping center. Can you please bring something to ease my wife's suffering? Come here. Look, there's only one evac chopper left in... 
So how do I get out of here? Okay, all right. You need to get a bag I dropped in the mechanic shop. It has smoke pods to signal the FEMA choppers. These things? Yeah, okay. You go back. Get my wife and Harrison. Once we light those smokers, we have 90 seconds to pick up. I'll update you on the radio. Let's light them up then. The sooner I'm out of here, the better. You don't bring them back. You're not... Come on, go! You don't bring them back. You're not getting on. Come on, go! You saved me! You did it! Thank God for you! What happened to Aiden? Chopper came and took him. Wouldn't let him off. They're going to Atlanta. Which is where I'm going. You coming with me? It's Atlanta then. <laughs> 